Welcome to ASMR Secret Santa 2017. This is a very excited Emma. I have a package here which I'm going to open. I have a very good idea who it's from and I'm just going to open it and show you everything that's inside um, and find out what's inside for myself. Secret Santa was organised by GB ASMR this year and it's something we used to do quite a while ago in the old days at the of the ASMR community and um, I really enjoyed it one year. I think it was last year or the year before I said no because I was just so overwhelmed with stuff that was going on in my life. I was so busy and I didn't have the time. So when the message came along this time to be involved I was really excited and just said yes, definitely. So I'll leave a list and links underneath this video of everyone who took part so you can check out their Secret Santa videos when they come out. Um, but for now this one is mine and uh, everybody loves getting presents, don't they? Who doesn't? So can I open it now? <laughs> okay, this is the box. As you can tell, I think, yes, this tape here, it's from the United States. It's a very nice sounding box, quite big. I tipped it this way or the other way before and there was something kind of jingly inside. I can't wait to find out. <laughs> but we're going to do this in the ASMR fashion, okay? I'm going to try and keep this nice and relaxed. It's calm and peaceful. the labels and stuff from the top and uh, just cut around the top just so that um, I would do all the noisy bits beforehand. This is the first time. Wow. <sighs> Opening the top. Okay. Thank you for using Priority Mail. No problem. Okay. This is my view right now. idea for filming ASMR videos is to try and keep yourself nice and calm and you know maybe do a little bit of breathing beforehand, have a little bit of time to yourself so that when the camera comes on everything's lovely and peaceful and at the moment that's not going on. I'm really excited. My heart's going to That's okay. For the beautiful Emma, thank you. Nice red envelope. Let's have a little bit of tapping. Not too much, because I want to open it. Let's try and open this. Okay.
Happy holidays to everyone. There's something inside. It's a lovely Christmas decoration with a gem on there. Little bow. holiday wishes Emma. Thank you for your warmth, kindness and dedication to all you do. As one of your biggest fans I think I speak for all of your loyal viewers when I say you are an asset, a blessing and a true gift to our community. With love and warmest holiday wishes, Ali. Enclosed, you'll find a photo of this awesome doll that has been donated on your behalf to the Toys for Tots program here in the US. She encourages young, young girls to pursue studies and careers in the STEM field. doing that, for donating that, and thank you for the um, proper photograph, because I'm going to treasure that. Thank you. There's a card, and there's a, a little jolly Santa, smiling. May your days be bright, and your heart And of course, it's uh, ASMR requests, Ali. Thank you. Wow, this is such an emotional video. Okay. So we have some bubble wrap on the top, as you saw. will be keeping and using in a video at some point because I have a drawer with loads of it in that I save. I always save packaging from stuff to either use in videos or to use in posting things. Okay, so we have, and I'll be really unprofessional and just check the time on my camera um, so that I don't carry on opening things and then the camera stopped filming. Okay, so there's one, two, three, four items in here wrapped up. So this should be an interesting sound experience. Thank you, Ali. voice is going a bit today so you might hear a few growls here and there. Look at this. Cute. 
cute candy cane paper and it feels glass solid it's glass Um, it has a nice sound. I'll shake it in your room, maybe you can work out what it is. It sounds like sleigh bells in the distance, doesn't it? I'll move this away so that the tearing sound is just a little less harsh for you. And the microphones. Oh, what's this? Okay. Oh. Okay, this looks really cool. Um, organic, check. Fair trade, check. <laughs> Mint rose, gourmet, herbal. And it's tea, of course. Welcome to the wonderful world of Zena's Tea. We created our small batch artisan crafted teas to delight your senses and please your palate. Thank you. Egy Egyptian peppermint and rose petals. Place five scoops in a tea infuser and add boiling water. So I have these uh, uh, Chinese uh, green tea cups with a separate uh, infuser that goes on the inside, which I'll use for this. I used it in one of the videos, the massage, um, oil massage. So I think some of you have seen it. I'll use that. And it looks really pretty as well some nice big petals. I bet it smells amazing. This is so cool, isn't it? I mean this whole thing. We really are a nice community of people and sometimes I find um, that it's hard to believe or to understand in the world that we live in, which is a shame, isn't it? But we really are, so it's nice to do stuff like this so that we can connect with each other in different ways and just, you know, spread some love. Give each other gifts and show each other how much we care about one another. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Um, my secret Santa person. Um, I had so much fun buying for them. It's just as much fun uh, getting 
and choosing gifts for someone else than it is receiving them. So this whole thing's been so much fun. And even just chatting to each other on the email, organising it all and everything. So I hope more people join in next year. I really do. I think we should do this every year. So there, okay, there's a big one, a medium one and a small one. I think I'm going to save the big one for last and go for the small one now. Okay, this one I'm saving for a video, for sure. It's lavender incense, 40 sticks and a ceramic holder, that's cool. Oh, that's really nice. smell really natural and real. I love that. Love it, love it, love it. And this cute little ceramic stand, because that's all you need, isn't it? Just a little stand. Sometimes I even use blue tack for my incense sticks. You just pop in the stick there. And it's heavy enough to stay and the stick will just pop in there and burn away nicely and they're purple These would be really nice for a bedroom because the big sticks take a long time to burn all the way down and you could just have one of these in the room. I have a really small bedroom so it would be just the right amount not to overpower so I think I'm going to use that and because they look so pretty I'm going to use them in a video. Okay so you'll see these again. And hear them again.
all in a nice box. Your work is really nice as well. Nice colours. Okay, now for the medium one. might be smashed. <laughs> I don't know. Sounds like it's something that has smashed in the post. So let's find out. <laughs> I'm going to open this carefully. Yes, it was something that was whole at one time, and it was whole glass. So, I think it looks like it's beyond repair. Let's have a look. tube that has had an accident oh it's a tea carafe I won't put my finger in because that might cause issues let's see if I can just take out the label This is a glass tea carafe, or was. <laughs> Removable stainless steel strainer allows for use with loose tea leaves. Double wall glass provides insulation suitable for hot or cold beverages. So I think it's a, it looks like it's a glass within a glass, I think. Is that right, Ali? So I'm just going to have to find another one, aren't I? Because I want to try this now. It's really cute and it's got a gold pattern on the outside. And that, that's the first lid. Then there's another one. Like a strainer. Oh, sorry, Ali. And it's dishwasher safe, but not postage safe.
There we go. Yeah, this is the inside piece. So you can brew your tea in it. Oh, I'll have a look for a replacement, okay? And try it. So now we're coming to the last bit. Can you guess what that is? And if you're wondering, um, when I open presents normally, I do tend to do it slowly anyway, okay? I'm one of those people. I enjoy the um, uh, delayed gratification of it all. And there are more gifts inside. This is a beautiful mug. So, okay. When I um, filmed with Maria, and we, she made a vlog of us um, behind the scenes. And um, when we were preparing for the video, she had a massive mug with tea in. And I thought to myself, why don't we have big mugs? Because we would have two or three cups, one after the other, in smaller mugs. And ever since, I've been feeling like my teacup is too small, because I want to drink more, especially in the winter. And um, I was thinking of get getting myself a really big mug for a nice big cup of tea in the morning. And now I have one. Thank you very much. And it has an E for Emma. And it has glitter on it. Because of course I like glitter. So this is the perfect mug for me. Thank you, Ali. I know why you've chosen this. For the glitter, for the E and for the T. There's a glittery bauble. Oh, wow. Yes. Let me put this down. You may or may not know that I have a thing about skulls. I have lots of things with skulls on, skull shaped stuff. And now I have a skull Christmas tree decoration. And it's glittery. So, glitter skulls. You can't get any better than that. And it's got little is in the eyes. A lot of thought went into this gift, you know, and a lot of 
looking around for the right thing. I think Ali went to quite a few shops to find these things. and stuff I have my mouth open so when I'm concentrating I'm like so I'm trying to close my mouth a little bit more and get used to breathing through my nose a bit more but I feel like I can't take enough air in and then sometimes um, you know when you go your nose whistles and it sounds loud So I'm going to develop a new skill, okay? Not that I feel like I have to change all the time for other people, but I think that um, it would be annoying for me as well. Ali, I shall treasure this Christmas decoration forever. There are certain Christmas decorations that have to be carefully, carefully packed away every single year because they are, and they each year they increasing, increasingly become a family tradition. I have a Star Wars one, now this one, and some uh, big silver baubles that were really cheap but because we've had them for about 10 years they they always go back into the original box and they're wrapped up and everything and if one of them was broken everybody would be really upset now this one is on that list thank you to leave that there there you go and It's labradorite. Lab labradorite. Labradorite. Pendant. I have a labradorite stone, which is quite. Um, um, it's about two, about an inch and a half wide. And um, when you look at them long enough you can see um, it kind of looks like oceans and you can see nature in them they they look like whole scenes because of all the different colors so if you look very closely at this stone and in, a, in the light I'm not sure if you'll be able to see so if I move it round you see the reflections the different light it's also a bit like mermaid tailish as well. So all the stones are different and you can see different scenes and settings in each one. It's such an amazing stone. Crystal. Yeah, this is really beautiful, thank you so much. It's the moon and the stars. And it makes a nice sound, so I could wear this in a video and just casually do that. Okay, so here's 
you look on the back as well. You can actually see all the way through, so I didn't notice that. There's no back on there, it's just the stone, so you can see the light all the way through. And there's more blue on the back. I'm not sure if you'd be able to see. I should make a video with all my different gemstones and just have make it really close up so you can see them all. Because this one especially is really beautiful to look at. All the different colours. Kind of see. Try not to go out of focus. There. See the reflection? Blues. There's a bit of brown in there on this one. Orange, red, yellow. Gorgeous. There's something else that's inside. It's the last thing to show you. And it looks really cool. Mmm. This is really handy for winter. It's so cold here now. And living in in the house with the heating on and then being outside, your skin goes through so much in the winter. So, and the hands are often neglected, ladies and gentlemen. So this one is perfect. Dry Hands Rescue, a moisturising and soothing treatment that helps replenish dehydrated hands in 20 minutes. Hydrating serum. Oh, so it's got gloves inside. Hydrating serum is filled in the gloves. Quickly improves skin hydration and protects against dehydrated hands. Free from parabens, sulfates and synthetic fragrances. And it sounds good. poured glitter on everything just for good measure because everything in life is made better with glitter and tea there is no situation that can't be improved with a little bit of glitter and a nice cup
And there we are, Secret Santa 2017. Thank you so much, Ali. I'm sure you had fun buying that stuff, because I know that it's fun to do. Um, but that was really amazing for me. I'm, I'm so grateful to you. Thank you. going to pop this on the windowsill by my tree, our tree, should I say, and uh, with all the other cards, and put the skull with all the other decorations, and put this by my desk. And I love handwritten stuff, it's just something to treasure forever, isn't it? Okay, I also keep every letter that anyone has ever sent to me, any card. I've put them all in a box just above where I do my editing and I always think of it as when I'm old, I'll sit with my brown box and just go through all the cards and letters from all those years ago and remember. And this will be one of them. Thank you. I hope you enjoyed watching that as much as I enjoyed opening everything and um once everybody's videos are uploaded, then I'll link them all below here so you can look around. Maybe we should put them all in a playlist or something so you can see them all and uh, see who got who and all of that because it was just random picking. It's just uh, picked on this random name picker on a Secret Centre website and it does it all for you. So it was really exciting to wonder who we were going to get. And quite a lot of people joined in as well, so there are a lot of videos for you to see. Merry Christmas. Or season's greetings. Whichever way you look at it, if it's family time or time to yourself or time to earn some extra money because you can get more hours at work whatever it is to you then I hope it's a wonderful one okay lots of love for me big glittery kiss